Okay, so this first modified exercise where I'm going to use a Swiss ball to assist the exercise if your full body weight is a little bit too uh, demanding um, and beyond, beyond your capabilities at the moment. So the Swiss ball is going to act as a surrogate in terms of some of the machines you see that take away some of your body mass so that you can do the exercise. Okay. Okay, next exercise is a vertical pulling exercise. Some would be familiar with things like lap pull down, um, chin up. So what I'm gonna do is use some resistance, a band, a PTP band, to take away some of my body mass so I can do the chin ups, um, but maybe beyond some, um, some trainee's capacity to actually do it just with body weight. So this is gonna be an assistance exercise. So have a look. Now another way that we can also um, circumvent uh, exercises that are beyond our concentric capacity, that means that, that positive or shortening part of an exercise, is to just focus on the eccentric part of the movement. So if you can't do a full dip eccentric on the way down and then coming up, you can modify it by just doing the eccentric, so concentrating on, on that range can be partial initially progressing through to a more full range. Once you get that eccentric strength up, which is potentially around that 130 to 140% of your normal one repetition maximum, whatever weight you can or load you can move through that eccentric concentric um, range of motion, you've got some flexibility there to do training just with the eccentric, and that is being shown to be very, very effective. So I'll just take a look, this is what I'm gonna do, just a negative um, section or eccentric um, portion of a, of, a, of a dip. So for this modification of this exercise, a dip again, rather than just doing the eccentric, using a band again to deload my body weight. 
so that I can get full range of movement and you can use different strengths of bands depending on how much you need to subtract from your body mass so that you can get that range of motion. So just um, take a look how the band will reduce that um, or deload that body mass so that I can execute the dip movement.